Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Rogues and Roleplayers. Welcome back. Blow this fucking door up. Fuck that door. There we go. Uh, so we're in, we're in the golden to the heart of the city. city. The, the heart of the golden city, which I don't know why I almost thought that there was a bunch of candles in the background. That is a lot of weapons. Wow. Those are all like bombs. <laughs> Bomblets. <laughs> that's that's a lot. That's a lot of bomblets. What am I dodging with? What? I love the thing like pulled up and it was like, <laughs> do this thing to dodge. I'm like, yeah, I, I locked that a while back and I didn't. Maybe really... it's giving you a reminder for something that's coming. That could be the case. Something's probably coming up soon, and it's just like, hey, don't rem remember that you can dodge. Don't forget about that. Wait, ah, be... fuck! I can't get through because it's got those little, those little uh, light. I guess barrier things. Okay. Okay. Oh, There's so got to be a, a way that we can get through those that's, later. That's a secret uh, passage, and uh, it's blocked by something. Okay. Whoa! Yeah, oh that, yeah, that thing can push you back. That's right. Yeah, it pushes you like way the fuck away. <laughs> it's just like, back off. Ow! Yeah, there's got to be a way that we're going to be able to get through this stuff later, because... I'm sure that's got to be a that weapon that has been that bothering get. me for so long. That's definitely a weapon that you get at some point later. Because, remember, we also had our little seahorse friend that was, like, pecking at one of those earlier. Yeah. Oh. Oh. At enemies. some point, you'll be able to get through those. Um, what are they? Like, they look like crystal walls or something? Yeah, I don't know if it's, like, crystal or... Something? I'm not sure. Is crystal a hard material? I don't yeah. remember. Is it? Yep. Yeah, rather hard. Wow, this is actually a little tricky with that little thing uh, <laughs> pushing you all over. At least the enemies are fairly weak. Just mm. put them in a corner and poke the shit out of them. <laughs> <laughs> that fish still cracks me up because of how much he looks like something from like Rayman. <laughs> Yeah, we need to play one of the Rayman games on the channel, I think. Definitely. You know what game, like, I I remember when I was young, I um, went to my cousin's house and I played Rayman 2 on the N64. And I remember really liking it, but I don't remember anything about it. <laughs> like, literally, I remember nothing about that game. But I remember when I was a kid, I was all about it. It's just like, I don't know, I need to check out Rayman 2 again one of these days and... I just know that the Rabbids are basically the best thing ever made. <laughs> those commercials were hilarious with those things. The Rabbids what the? themselves... Whoa. Whoa! I'm not sure, but I think that may be able to hurt me. Oh, actually, wait, no, because that was the light from earlier. Yeah. Oh, So it'll okay. hurt me if I'm not in the sub. That's wait right. a minute, does that mean we have another light puzzle? Well, okay, so we've got a uh -oh. warhead here. Huge ass warhead. Uh, what do we do with this thing? Oh, it looks like it'll blow up any second. <laughs> what do we do? I am assuming that if it touches the light, everything dies. <laughs> everything the light touches will die in a nuclear holocaust. <laughs> All right. So uh -oh. let's uh, uh, up the ramp with you. Uh, okay. Wait. It didn't touch the light. Oh shit! Don't let it touch the light! It'll no. destroy everything. It'll destroy everything. That's what I'm thinking. I may be dead wrong, but let's get Ooh. you over Come on. there. Alright. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's down below the- Shit. Oh fuck! That's bad. That's um, bad. Okay. Oh, okay, that actually really was not that bad of an explosion. <laughs> But, at least we were correct, if it touches the light, it blows up. Yes. So, um, But we exaggerated the explosion. Because we thought it would, you know, destroy everything. It would destroy this city, it would destroy the world, it would destroy the universe. I mean... No, no, no fuck, don't get in the current! No! no. Oh okay. no! Damn it! <laughs> okay. it's, like, it's like the city invented this bomb that is so powerful that it destroys everything. It's like and there has, there the is. only the only thing the, the the thing that makes it go off is this light, and they're like, why do we keep it next to the like right next to this light whenever we're not using it? <laughs> like it could literally just like lean forward and just blow everything up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> no. Why do we keep it here? Uh, okay. Surely uh, there's got to be honey. a safer place. <laughs> okay, so I have to get this thing to stay still there. And then when there's no current pushing it up, then I'll just push the warhead. <laughs> and then everyone <laughs> dies. <laughs> no, don't let it go up. Okay. So... Alright. You uh, can rest on my head until I know that it's safe. <laughs> there we go. Aha! Mine head. And I, I don't think I can push it through this. Nope. Hmm. Well, there's got to be something that you can Ooh. use. Oh, why is that thing blinking? Oh, really? It probably has a certain level of, like, a timer. Well, like, then what did okay, we do Okay, so I'm having for? to use, like, exclusively my sonar to navigate right now. Because of all this smog. Of smog. 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 Uh, there we go. All Get this some treasure. Smog. We are so close to the Thunderclaw. Smaug calling all this, causing all this desolation. Because the Fomori are also kind of polluting the living shit out of the uh, ocean, I think. Hmm. Yeah, you have to really rely on that sonar. Oh. It looks like a wall that you can break. Yeah. There we go. There you go. Okay. More sonar. More things for you to destroy. Destroy the red circles. Go with the claw. There we go. Oh, that's a lot destroy of Destroy all the red circles. You must destroy all of them. Aha. Uh -huh. Whenever right. you see a so red circle, here. you destroy it. Ooh, yay. Treasure. <gasps> Is this enough? Yay! Next time we see Hermes, we get Thunderclaw! Ah! Oh man, we're actually gonna get Thunderclaw? Yep. Oh, nice. Oh, I need to find Whoa. a head. I think this may be the head right here. Oh, okay. Yep, there it is. It's just like a polygon shape whenever you can't even see it. Uh, alright. And, uh, there you go. Put the head ha, on ha, ha, ha. Put the head on top of the Krusty Krab. And then that opens this little <laughs> door. So we can go to the even more darker and polluted area. <laughs> the chest piece on those things to me still kind of looks like the crusty crab. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's probably just me. As but... long as SpongeBob is in your heart making <laughs> Krabby Patties, then you're fine. There we go. Well, SpongeBob and is in my... That means that you no. also if Sponge... have... Ooh, does the smog block this if thing's SpongeBob view? If SpongeBob is in my heart making Krabby Patties, then that would make oh, me no. a very, very happy person. It just blocked my view. As long as he here. doesn't laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor goes to listen to your heart. And he just hears me and he's like <laughs> <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> Mr. Nasuda, uh, there's only one way to put this medically. What the fuck is up with your heart? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well this doesn't seem like such a heart puzzle. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh god, that would be horrible if your heartbeat was actually SpongeBob's laugh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you would not only hear it whenever a doctor is trying to listen to it but you would hear it anytime you're in a situation where you can hear your own heartbeat so like whenever you're laying in bed at night and you can hear your own heartbeat it's just a constant flow of ah, ah, ah. it's like it's like why have I been cursed with this <laughs> this is the worst <laughs> The worst curse is Spongebob <laughs> eating brought first. There we go. He laughs when he eats it. He's like, ah, dick jokes. And... <laughs> I love. <laughs> oh, this is so many things here. You will all die. <laughs> it's like, it's okay. like, huh? I guess it's I like was you, correct and they all died. It's there like you, you can't you can't go to the gym and exercise anymore because every time you get really heated up from exercising you just start hearing ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Um I am very confused right now. Um I can't get through that wall. I honestly don't oh, know. Oh, although my sonar. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. 
So that kind of just blew it up from the inside. Yeah, so with that particular lever, the, uh, the bomb has to not be on the thing. So when the bomb is on, it closes that gate. Okay. But now it makes me wonder what I'm doing. Wait, can you, like, push the bomb over to that wall and break it? That's actually a really good idea. Hey, give that a try, see if that works. Because you might be able to break that. And then sonar it. Very clever. Nice. Alright. Uh, so now we go up here. Hmm. I don't even know what this is, but I want it! I want it! Forever! <laughs> Literally no idea what I just did. Alright, uh... Can you imagine if every single bomb in this place went off at once? Oh, that would be pretty <laughs> horrible. Yeah. You see, the ones that have the chain, usually there's something heavy that you gotta drop on them. But it always makes me wonder, because if there's not, like, a big area... Mm. For something heavy to fall, then what do you do? I don't know. But we must. Can I? Okay, that's not a sonar switch. Uh, I guess we're just going to keep going up. Uppy, uppy, uppy. Alright, so now that we've uh, pretty well established what we do uh, with uh, these little puzzles here <laughs> and all that good stuff. Then uh, I guess we're just gonna see you guys next time on Rogues and Roll Players. Then yeah, see you next bombs. time. Lots of bombs. Lots of bombs and bombs. We'll blow up all the bombs we need. <laughs> blow up all those fucking rabbits. <laughs> Declaring war on rabbits, by the way. <laughs> Declare war on rabbits. Yep. All right. Well, then Bugs Bunny's got to die. No wait. You know what? We actually don't need to worry about Bugs Bunny. James Rolfe took care of him. <laughs> <laughs>